laughs> She's laughing at me. Hey, it's Lenny Gale with Life is Only Oak. Today we're so excited. We're at the Vitamix store with Michelle, uh, our, our old friend, and not old, our, our, oh, our, our, our <laughs> friend that we've had for a long time. And so it, instead of just making something today, uh, a green juice, every other green juice, uh, we, I want to ask the question that I love asking everyone, and that is, what's in your morning blend? So. Michelle? You, I'm just gonna say you asked for it. Yeah. So that's a question people come in all the time when they're looking at Vitamix and they go, well, what do you make on your Vitamix? Yeah. And when we're doing the demo, we usually do the going green smoothie. Yep. That's a really sweet green smoothie. Yeah, that's a starter. Yeah, and, I'm, and I tell them, you're not ready for this. This is advanced level. You can't handle this. You can't handle this. Well, no, so what cannot. are we making? Um, what did you call it? I, the Before girls here at the store call it my icky green juice. <laughs> okay. Because it does look kind of icky in the container. And I will admit when I started with this, yeah. it was not so easy. And I've kind of used this as like a um, like a mid-morning, early afternoon bridge and then I eat lunch a little bit later okay. now. It's right. my little boost. But anyways, there's not a lot of sweet in here. Okay. That's great. You gotta have, you know, your your taste buds evolve. Exactly. And don't need as much sweet. Well, and that's what I tell them with the going green smoothie, the one that we demo in the store yeah. all the time, is like you just kind of start easing back on that and omitting one. You know, first you use half of one of the fruits, and eventually you can get to something that's more um, vegetable based. Sure, sure. Um, it's just a matter of letting your palate adjust. Yes. So, are you ready? I'm ready. Icky right. green. Icky green juice. Here we go. All right. Um, I use almond milk in my smoothies just because I think it helps them stay emulsified a little bit longer. Yeah, and yeah. Like the creaminess that it adds. Okay. So, liquids down first. Yep. Always, oh, always, li always. Liquids first. Liquids first. And then um, next comes leafy greens, okay. which I've got about two cups of spinach. And when I'm at home, I just take giant handfuls right out of the bag in okay. there. And I get just about as much as I can in there. Which is again leads to the icky greenness. Always spinach. You ever change up the green or just spinach? I do, depending on what I at home. It's yeah. like if I've got romaine lettuce or a little bit of kale. I don't do all kale. Kale is like a stronger thing, and I usually like to blend my greens. I agree. I'm, yeah, and, it's and not for everybody. It is strong, and even when we make uh, kale salads, we mm -hmm. let the dressing sit on it to yes. kind of absorb and yes. soften up a little bit. I like that better. The other thing I'm going to do is juice with half a lemon. Okay. Lemons are a really great way to kind of wake up your smoothie. Yeah. Um, Depending on what I've got going on at home, sometimes I'll use juice of half a lemon. Sometimes I'll just take, I'll leave the rind on and just make like a quarter inch slice of lemon. Yes. It just depends. So for you, I did the actual juice of a lemon. Then obviously anything dense, which in this case is some celery, okay. some cucumber. I didn't bother to seed it or yep. take the skins off. Yep. Sometimes I use an English cucumber, sometimes a regular one, whatever's on hand. Okay. Half a pear. That's my only sugar going on. Half a pear. Yep. And this, this solid stuff's going to help kind of push everything down. You got yep. it. And then my fro the only frozen this is some ice cubes just okay. to cool it down and thicken it up a little bit, although it's pretty thick on its own. Okay. And we'll let that, if I'm doing manual, you just let it blend until you don't see the specks of spinach. I'm using the smoothie setting on this one. I'm going to the stop the program because I know this one's done already. Yep. All right. It's really green. It looks icky. Actually, no, it looks, it looks really, really good. I don't know about it, that. I, I can, thank you. I can smell the, like, the vegetables. Yeah, definitely. Um, the, the celery, especially. Like, yeah, the and the and cucumber celery. will come through to a lot, too. Cheers. Cheers. Have, Cheers. have a Cheers. taste. He didn't flinch. That's no, a good it's, sign. It's very good. It's not icky. It is. <laughs> it is a rare. It is a rare vegetable juice. It's a vegetable juice. It really yeah, is. And it, is. it 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 doesn't taste like grass. No. It is, it is quite good. It's really really good. I've made it before when I haven't had the lemon, and the lemon really. Yeah. That's actually a, that's the key component because otherwise it's almost too 
celery. Yeah, yeah. got to do lemon. You could, you could spice it up. You could do a little jalapeno in here too if you that like spicy. Really, actually, that's a great idea. I'm gonna yeah. Try that one. And I, I like it. This is not like, this is not a treat. This is not candy, but like you are treating yourself, your body. To, you feel good after. Yeah, no, really. It's a good shot. Too, I feel so. great. So this is not your morning blend per se, but this is your late morning, early afternoon blend. Yes. Right? You got to be awake to have a thing like this. I'm like, I can't do this first thing in the morning. Okay. It's better for me a little bit later in the day. But if you were going to make a morning blend, maybe, maybe be something a little sweeter. Maybe. Yeah, I know. It's a cup of coffee. And or a cup of don't coffee. Don't talk to me until after that. <laughs> I have to have the coffee first. Yeah, That's yeah, the yeah. one thing I can't seem to get rid of. Yeah, well, we, we, we do say that this, this type of thing can replace coffee, like that feeling of being energized. Yes, absolutely. I, we, I still love the taste of coffee and having it in the morning. Even though I don't need it, I go weeks without it and I'm fine. I just, I just enjoy life with a little coffee too, so... You can have both, right? Absolutely. Have your green juice and eat your coffee too. <laughs> icky green juice in the morning. You don't share this with your your, your family because it's too my icky. My kids my kids like cringe when they see it coming out of the blender. <laughs> oh, I like it. I like it. The only problem is, is you can't tell the difference between the look of icky green juice and like a delicious green juice. That's true. Yeah. So we don't want to like we don't want to scare people. So well, when it comes for the kids too, I always say a slice of beet in there changes it to purple. <laughs> okay, okay. So if you're trying to get those greens in for your kids, I always do that too. Hide the color. Make it purple. Mm -hmm. I'll keep that in mind. My dad's yeah. afraid of green stuff too. All right, Icky Green Juice, Michelle, uh, Vitamix Retail Store in Solon, Ohio. Life is enough. Thank you for watching. Cheers. Keep it icky. Hey, we're so excited. We're here in Solon, Ohio uh, at the Right? Yeah. What's so funny? No, you're like, we're so excited to be in Solon. We are. <laughs> I'm thrilled to be here. She's laughing at me. <laughs>